Hey what's up guys Rahul here and welcome to Gizmo Byte. If you own a 16 GB iOS device, you probably are concerned about the storage space and most of you don't know the fact that you cannot delete the temporary or cached files from your iOS device as Apple doesn't let you do that. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how to delete the temporary cached and junk files from your iOS device running iOS 10 to 10.2, even iOS 9 and free up storage space all without the need of a jailbreak and some bonus tips in the end as well. So let's begin. You're going to need two things. Click the first link in the description to download CDI Impactor for your respective operating system and then just click the second link in the description which will automatically download xCleaner app. Now CDI Impactor will be a zip file which you will need to extract and after extracting it will reveal an impactor.exe file. Right click on the impactor.exe file and hit open. Do not hit run as administrator for whatever reason and then plug in your iOS device. Another thing is that iTunes should be pre-installed on your computer for this method to work but it shouldn't be running in the background. Back to the impactor, you can see that it will recognize your iOS device in the upper tab. Now all you need to do is simply drag the xcleaner IPF file and drop it onto the impactor window. Then it's going to ask you for an Apple ID and this needs to be a working Apple ID as impactor will be signing the app with your Apple ID. So don't worry because it's 100% safe. After entering the Apple ID and password, you might have to press OK for an upcoming warning and then Impactor will do its thing and xCleaner will pop up on your iOS device. Obviously you cannot open it right away as it will be untrusted, so head over to Settings, General, Profiles and Device Management or just Device Management depending on your device and then trust the profile marked with the email address you just used and then you will be able to open up the app. But first, let's check how much free space do we have right now. So I'll get into storage and iCloud and I can see around 3.4 GB of free space. Now let's open up the xCleaner app and run it. It's gonna take some time so I'll speed it up. You will get the storage almost full warning so don't bother just hit done. And just like that all the temporary junk and cache files have been deleted. Let's go to storage and iCloud and check again. Now free space is 3.64 GB, that's approximately 220 MB of junk deleted. Now this will depend on devices and the amount of data that you have on your device and the result is purely subjective and the best part about this software is that it also deletes the residual files left behind which would normally be done only through a restart. Obviously it's not going to make a radical difference but here are a few tips. Use Google Photos and upload all the photos that you capture to it as Google Photos allow unlimited photo storage and the quality will almost be same as that of the original. As for music, you can use Google Play Music and upload all your downloaded music to it as it allows storage of 50,000 songs and then you can stream it anywhere you want. Other than that, I have made a few videos on how to get premium versions of popular streaming apps like Spotify and Deezer, so I'll leave a link up top and a link down below in the description as well. That's been it for this video guys, be the cool guy or girl who leaves a like down below, subscribe for awesome content like this and until next time, this is Rahul, signing off, peace.